the problem? Too little bandwidth and too little time. And the answer was uh, compress it all. Honestly, 90 to 95 percent is what we get. And it's it's insane. It's fantastic. You're saving money on your data egress, your VMs. Yep. And what does your company do? Well, we do advertising market research. So let's just say a quick example. So you'd open up Tableau and you'd say, well, I don't know, do, do people named Fred like to buy this car? And how do you find that out? You can pull up a ton of data and just see if it makes any sense. But that data would take forever and it's so much. Now, the SQL Server was fast. And our computers are fast when they get the data, but the pipeline in between was limited. So they have to just take huge chunks of data and bring it into one place and then chop it all up. And uh, we use Tableau as our BI tool, our business intelligence tool, to get that information out and our data scientists make some sense of it from there. Now, because we decided to go with Azure and host this on, on a cloud server, which is basically a virtual machine, because we did that, uh, we don't have the bandwidth that you would typically have when you have an on-prem SQL Server. One of the things that made us choose Azure was because uh, the licensing for a SQL enterprise is far less expensive if you pay hourly. Microsoft uh, limits the amount of bandwidth that you can get out of certain virtual machines. So I experimented initially with extracting to a file, compressing the file, sending it over, re-extracting the file, and then using that as a separate data source. But then you lose the SQL Server connection and all the other stuff that goes along with that. Through searching, I found your tool. So the installation was insanely simple. It was as easy as restarting a process. And suddenly, and I don't know what your, what your developers are doing, but it's just, uh, it's, it's so silly that it, and, and I know hardware exists that does similar stuff, but it's, monumentally expensive and you also can't do it from a from a, a laptop you know in an airport to a, an actual machine yeah you, you have to be within a data center to do it or within a, in a location and that's part of our issue is when we're showing a client saying hey look at all this great stuff you know, oh crap i need to update this data let me update it real quick and then you can uh, you can get it 100 to uh, you know whatever that is depending on the compression ratio to, to your computer in a place that would typically have a really poor connection. We're saving on server licensing because we pay hourly, VM because we pay hourly, and uh, again, people's sanity, which is invaluable.